Hey you guys, welcome back to Easy Six Covered. Appreciate you showing up and I want to show you this cool video. And the reason why it's cool is because I got my thermal imaging unit, which is a Leupold LTO. It's the tracker. So you can see that right there. And it has a pretty a lot of different options as far as different colors of screen, all that kind of stuff, different heat signatures. You can make it where it's bright white, green, red, all sorts of stuff and uh, black so depending on what you're using and how you're using it you can switch and transfer over there is a couple modes where you can zoom in a little bit this thing works pretty good at deer like 150 yards from the house you can see them walking around or bedded down in the grass field but i got this to match up perfectly well with a very cheap red dot the reason why i'm using this red dot it's a tasco red dot and a lot of people give these crud and there is way better stuff out there but i just turned this on i rebuilt this rifle and uh i'm basically trying to run like a around the house kind of at night i got a i got a surefire light on here with a pressure switch and this cheap red dot <laughs> still works it's been sitting in the in the closet for a while i turn it on and it's working perfect so i said man i'm gonna see if this will match up with this uh, leupold tracker so this is a thermal imaging unit but i want to show you the quality that you get and uh the way this setup is set up i'm hoping that this would be a cool little unit to run so as long as the red dot is confirmed and is at zero you will see it in the screen there. So you can see the heating coils on the freezer. You can see the doggies sitting there wondering what I am doing. What is dad doing? Got another dog over there. Rusty. Rusty, come here. Come here, Rusty. Rusty, come here. Rusty, come on, buddy. Come here. Oh, there's a different dog. But you can see that it works. The red dot. Trying to keep the glare out. But that is what it's looking like right now. Let's switch the screen over. Now everything that's hot is white. Two more dogs there, one looking at me. Switch it over now to a cool, basically everything that's hot is black. That's actually got some good quality uh, when it comes to recognition of your target. Biscuit, biscuit. Let's see if I can see a tail wagon, you can see a tail wagon. <laughs> No heat there. Next color up. Hot is white still with extra hot being the red. That is his face. Let's see if we can go to this dog. You can see where his head's at. And Ruger. You can see a back up, buddy. You can see the heat. Ruger Dooger. Ruger Doogie. That's kind of cool. All right. Next color. This one you can see the hottest portions of it. Set up at night. Obviously the face. And you can see the freezer in the background. So I think this is going to work pretty cool. I just need to make sure that the red dot is red. Where it needs to be accurate and then re here's the picture of what i'm looking at right there so you can see the freezer and the coils you see my dirty garage dog down there chewing on a bone but i think this is going to work awesome so now in the screen 
You can, I don't know if you can see the red dot. Let me see. There is a red dot when you're looking through it. Um, but that's it. You can see the coil. So, pretty cool. I'm looking at. I think this is going to work out perfect. So, I'll be able to walk around the house at night if I hear bumps in the dark i'll be able to stay uh i'll be able to stay dark see my way through especially being at my house i know where everything's at for the most part except for those dreaded legos glad the kids grew out of that stuff Woo! those things are sharp at night so you step on one of those you're gonna scream <laughs> so i'll show you how this thing uh may or may not work so once we get it all set up, which is basically set up now, but um, let's wait for darkness. Right now you can see the camera's all where the heat is on the camera, which is pretty cool. Don't be scared, you're not gonna get shot, okay? This is YouTube. Going through all the different options there. You can see the greens, the reds, the whites, the blacks. 